Hey team, welcome back to the channel. Like I said, we're gonna remove these bushes today. We've got one, two, three, four. We're gonna use the FJ to tow them out. I did this with two bushes, one there and one there. So if you're like me, you've bought an established house and you've got some old style landscaping or overgrown landscaping, there's a lot of different ways to remove this. One way is to simply cut it down and then dig up the root system by hand, which is a pain in the butt. So we're gonna just drag it out and uh, we'll deal with the root, ball, the root ball, root, 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 the root ball when we can. this first bush we're gonna remove. I basically cut myself a little hole in here. So I get down into the base and attach the rope. So. All right, hopefully this works. Strap around the main trunk. Let's go ahead and hook up the FJ. Tail rope. Well, this has been one giant epic fail. I did this with two bushes before, but this one is not budging. We didn't pull them up, so we're gonna have to do this the hard way, which is cut them into pieces and dig out the root ball by hand. All right, so that wasn't a win. Sometimes you gotta try things and you gotta fail hard. So let's go to the Sawzall, tear this thing down piece by piece, and then we'll dig out the root ball, probably not today, but in the spring, so, oh well. All right, today is one of those days where you think everything is gonna go right and it doesn't, it goes wrong. 
I really thought that I'd be able to pull out these two bushes with the FJ. It didn't go to plan. I couldn't get enough traction. I think this root system's a bit bigger than the ones I pulled out before. But we still got them cut down. It's not that big of a deal. We will continue trying to do things, new things, old things I know that work. And we're just learning. We're just getting better. That's what do-it-yourself is all about. So lesson learned. If you guys like this video, go ahead and hit that like button. If you want to stick around, hit subscribe, and I'll see you next time. And oh yeah, I'm going to have a big dirt spot here. I'd really love to know in the comments what you think I should do with this section. Should I do new landscaping, or should I do some new grass, test plots, uh, something like that. So we'll see you next time.